Hey, it's Robert from Hobby Man ZXC. Hope you guys are having a great day. The website that loves me so much, Radio Discussion Board, is talking about how 1071 becomes a translator. I mean, it's on backup power. <laughs> it's supposed to be licensed to uh, Bastrop. Their tower is near Garfield. Garfield is just a bit west of Bastrop, suburb of Boston. Hello, everyone. It runs 50,000 watts, but they're, they are now moved temporarily to the 360 towers at only 200 watts. That's quite a downgrade. There's something wrong with the tower and bass drop, so they had to massively decrease from 50 to 200 watts. You would think 200 would be a bigger number and 50 would be a smaller number, but it's 50,000 watts. Now it's... 200 watts it may be closer to leander but since its tower is well its wattage is so sad um it's really hard to get it that's why in my band scan you were able to get kess 1071 near uh weatherford texas i was able to get an hd i was able to get kess 1071 out of Fort Worth in HD. Oh, by the way, blinded by the light behind me. Let me see if I can get KESS on FCC data. Ah, the black screen of death. My mortal enemy. <laughs> All right, that's just a, a funny joke. Let's see here. Da -da 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 -da. KESS. 107.1 We're a Spanish station, but yeah. Okay, so their tower is, okay, KESS's tower is is south of Weatherford. Weatherford is near Fort Worth. And they can go as far well the FCC claims they can only go as far as uh Dublin. But let's see its um actual real coverage area. <laughs> I don't know why it's slow at loading. I just wanted to see. I was able to get KESS and KDXX 107.9, and both in HD, on my um, Insignia radio. So here's its real signal. Don't listen to the FCC. They, they're not as reliable as they want you to believe. Okay, so go. it can actually go Comanche. Here's Comanche right here below Dublin. Let me see. Is my hand there? There's there's Comanche. I'm pointing right at Comanche. There is Dublin right there. Not to be uh, confused with Dublin, Ireland. Okay, uh, Hamilton is Hamilton is right here. I look at the orange or the blue, not the green. The FCC limits how far a signal can go here's decatur decatur here's bridgeport where it's supposedly ends but it really technically ends near bowie where's my hand there we go there's bowie texas that's north of fort worth so i was able to get a station that's Halfway between Granbury and Weatherford, Texas. Here's Granbury and here's Weatherford. KESS. So 1071, let's check out KGSR. Oh, or I mean KLZT. <laughs> KLZT. Okay, I have trouble with this. Here's where they're supposed to be broadcasting. Hey, neat, Leander. That's nice. Leander is right here. And it goes all the way down to Luling. Yeah. And the, I don't know where they're... Okay, 1986. Eh, it's backup tower is nowhere to be seen. I don't see an auxiliary tower. So, it never really has been on the 360 towers before. Weird. So, yeah, it's always been here.
at, near Garfield. Okay, here's Bastrop. It's, there's there's my finger. This is Bastrop where it's licensed. Here's where it is near like uh, Del Valley. Del Valley and Garfield. Garfield's like around here, I think. But it says they're uh, being broadcast on the 360 towers. Not at like 39 to 40,000 watts. They're only broadcasting at 200 watts. And um, yeah, I think their HD hash is off, which is good. KLFX 107.3 has a chance to come in. And thanks to 103.5's HD hash being off, I'm able to try to get the ghost of KL, KVIL out of Dallas. Man, HD really should just go away. It's just a novelty that that they tried in 2002. It doesn't work. They say that, oh, the signals go further. That's why they have to be weaker. No, you're just kind of saving money and you're just making excuses, FCC. You're afraid of station going very far. That's why you block them with translators. Isn't that true? You don't like signals going very far, do you? <laughs> Me, I like to see how far a signal can go. That's basically why uh, Marconi invented the radio, to see how far a signal can travel. Radio is supposed to travel as far as it can and deliver information, not be blocked by translators, yo. Or HD hash. People forgotten what radio is supposed to be. It's supposed to entertain people and it's supposed to travel as far as it can go. Well, those days are done. Now everything is done by a cult regime or a big corporate suit, yo, that doesn't even care about radio and only cares about money. So in any case, 1071, I don't know if I care because um, there's already a lot of Spanish stations and I'm still holding a vendetta for you moving KGSR to 93.3 and later 971 and calling it ACL. Yeah. Um, by the way, the last fun band to come out of Austin was Fastball. It's kind of true. <laughs> and ACL is kind of a joke nowadays. It really was kind of the last band to come out of Austin. Fastball. I don't know what to tell you. You guys have a great day. I'm Robert from High Man ZXC. What do you think of 1071 on auxiliary power? Let me know in the comments. I'm Robert from High Man ZXC. Have a great day in this long video.